Good morning, students. How are you all? I hope you all are fine and good at your home. So, students, today we are going to start lesson one, networking concept. So, my question is, what is network? What is network? Or why we use network? We are talking about network then in our daily life we comes across different type of network like banking network, network of road, network of railways, communication network system for telephone which enables us to talk with anyone anywhere at any time. So we have different type of network and you should understand that imagine your life without internet, without television, without phone, can you imagine if you don't have any phone, if you don't have television or network, you are, we will get bored, we will get bored without internet because we cannot see anything, we cannot share our data or files. We, can, we cannot search, we cannot see the entertaining programs. So, without these things, without these life, we get bored. So, basically, if we are talking about computer network, because topic is computer network. So, if we are talking about computer network, then computer network is So, 
that's my see open so that's why computer network is very important in our daily life very important for us now this is the basic introduction of computer network so second topic is advantages of networking advantages of networking so first advantage is first advantage is efficient use of storage media first advantage is efficient efficient use of storage media efficient use of storage media so what is efficient use of storage media what is the meaning of that particular point so if we have some files if we have some files and store and want to store in computers and want to store in computer then no need to store that particular file in all the computers we just store in one computer and all rest all computer can access easily if these computer are connected in a network if these computer are in network then all these computer can access that particular file easily from single computer and second point is second point a single computer or we can say a stand alone computer may have some storage limitation but if several computer connected to each other then storage capacity may get increased and all computer can use that storage capacity so this is the meaning of efficient use of storage media
It means, it means we can send or deliver the documents instantly over the internet from one computer to other computer. I repeat my friend. The meaning of this particular point is we can send or deliver the document instantly or quickly over the internet from one computer to other computer. So these are the main and basic advantages of networking. Students, you can pause the